Hi, I'm Matt Rabin, team chiropractor of Garmin Sharp Professional Cycling Team. I'm here with Will Stevenson today, youngest starter and finisher of the 2013 Tour of Britain. Just gonna take you through three very simple tape jobs which you can use yourself, do yourself, um, for those small, irritating little niggles, give you a little bit of support. So we use this a lot in professional cycling. During a stage race, it might be six or seven stages long, you can't afford to just take two or three days off the bike. So we've got to try and find a way to get through it. So oftentimes we'll treat it, and to give it a little bit of support through throughout the duration of the race, we can put a bit of kinesio tape, or rock tape in this case, on the area. I'm just gonna show you how we do that, just to try and offload and alleviate some of those symptoms. Tape job number one is for the knee. It's a generic knee taping. Anytime you've got sort of pain or discomfort across the anterior area of the knee here from riding your bike, either in the saddle or out of the saddle, there's no harm in using this tape job just to give your knee a little bit of support. What it will do is it will try to facilitate your quadriceps muscles in here at the same time as offloading the knee joint in there. It's a very simple tape job. We use two bits of tape, which we're gonna pre-cut now and then apply the tape and we'll show you how we do that. We'll start with the tape inside the cycling short. This way you've got a good opportunity for it not to come off when you're cycling. So how we measure it is start with the tape just through here. I'm gonna run it across the front just till we get to the bottom of the kneecap, just in here. And then we're gonna cut our first bit of tape like so. We put, run it back across the front here, run our finger to the top of the kneecap. And just up to this point here, we're gonna make a little fold. Okay, so now we've got a bit of tape with a fold in the middle. We take the shorter end of that fold and we cut the tape in two, split the tape in two, sorry, right down the middle, like so. So now we've got our first bit of tape, which looks just like this. As you can see, we've just beveled the edges around the outside, just gives it a better opportunity to, to not flick up and come off. Second bit of tape for the knee, to measure the tape, we're just gonna run it around the front of the kneecap, nice and generous with the tape in here. So we've got a nice U-bend like so. And from here again, we're just gonna cut the tape. And this is gonna give us our second bit of tape. So we peel back the tape, roll up the leg a fraction. Just peel off the tape like so, and we get down to here to tuck that back over like that. Then we just flip this over, and we want to tear the tape off to that point. So now we've just got these two bits exposed like so. So then we take them off one at a time. And now I'm just gonna just guide this bit of tape around the inside of his knee onto here, and you'll find a little bony ridge just at the front there like that. And we're gonna do the same thing with the other bit of tape until they meet in the middle. So the kneecap sits inside this first bit of tape. For the second bit of tape, for the knee, fold in half to find the midpoint like so. And then what we're gonna do with this bit of tape, we just tear it like that, like you would a Band-Aid. We expose about an inch of tape. Just gonna pull that tight, like so. And we apply it so it's halfway up the kneecap, like that. And we stick that down here. Let's get you to just hold that for me. So then we take this bit of tape off here. We just peel the tape off. Just a very gentle stretch, of about 10, 15% of the stretch. Roll that round onto here. For the other side, same thing, just pull the tape off. About 10, 15% tension, just gonna roll that up round towards the front. So now from the front, we see this knee, half of the tape here is over the kneecap, and this bit of tape here out down the front, this is helping to facilitate the quadriceps muscle in here. When we put these bits of tape around here, the tension, we just pull it as tight as we need to get around that corner like so. Because they were cut in a straight line, you will need to pull it a little bit tight just to get, reach around there. To get the tape warm, just by rubbing it a little bit, helps to just warm up the glue, which allows it to stick. And this would be good for a four hour ride at least. 
So if you've got a pain in your knee, click on here. If you're getting pain in your low back, click on here. If you're getting pain and discomfort in your Achilles, click on here. And as he does that, he's slowly progressing his way up the leg just to try and flush out some of the lactic acid buildup that you might get after a ride. So you're using the opposite leg here on top of the leg.